now i am going to developing here circlet first of all we need to import java x dot servlet servlet dot star package the next import java dot io dot star package the next public class class so now welcome servo welcome servo extends extends generic servlet generic servlet now after that we need to take here public void service service under that we can take servlet request servlet request req comma servlet response servlet response response res then throws throws servlet exception servlet exception comma io exception servlet exception comma io exception after that we can take here what okay we can take here what i want to displaying the that information from server side to browser side if you want to displaying the from server side to browser side now here first we need to get the one socket we need to get the one socket that means we need to get the browser stream object we need to get the browser stream object so now how to get the browser stream object here print writer print writer pw is equal to res dot get writer get writer now we are getting the we are getting the browser stream object after getting the browser stream object we can print the welcome message now we can write our information on browser stream object how to write like this pw dot println pw dot println now we can take here some html code html html now after that pw dot println body bg color equal to body bg color equal to bg color equal to yellow yellow then next after that pw dot println println now what we have to take here what we have to take here okay so now welcome to servlet technology welcome to servlet technology first we have to take the marq tag marq tag under that h1 now we can take welcome to welcome to servlet technology servlet technologies close the h1 close the marq tag after that pw dot println pw dot println now we can take here close the body then next after that 
पीडब्ल्यू डाट प्रिंटर लेन नाउ क्लोज द एच टी एम एल क्लोज द एच टी एम एल द नेक्स्ट आफ्टर दैट वी हाव टू क्लोज द ब्रउजर शीम आबजेक्ट पीडब्ल्यू डाट क्लोज दट अनफ आफ्टर दैट क्लोज द मेथड क्लोज द क्लास क्लोज द मेथड क्लोज द क्लास close the method close the class now we can save this one where we can save that one in our project src folder otherwise we can store directly classes folder not a issue either src or we can place classes folder control v dot java the next after that we need to develop the web dot xml file we need to develop the web dot xml file how to develop web app under that we can take servlet servlet the next servlet name servlet iphone name now here i am taken servlet name is what okay two i am taken tw2 your choice any name you can take close the servlet name next servlet class servlet iphone class now here what is the servlet class welcome welcome servo close the servlet class servlet iphone class the next after that close the servlet the next servlet mapping servlet iphone mapping the next servlet name iphone name the next to close the servlet name servlet iphone name the next url pattern url pattern the next slash i am going to take the url pattern here welcome welcome close the url pattern after that close the servlet mapping servlet typhon mapping then close the web app that's enough this is the way this is the way to configuring the one servlet the next we can save this one where we can save under web inf now web dot xml web dot xml now first before deploying before deploying we have to compile our servlet we have to compile our servlet if you want to compile then what we have to do go to the d directory cd space video sessions for advanced java the next cd space servlets cd space welcome app cd space web by nf cd space classes the next set class path equal to set class path equal to we have to set like this
the next offer that java c welcome sir we are getting five errors right what is the problem see 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 the problem set class path equal to PATH right now we can compile compilation success right after that we can copy our project we can copy our project paste into the tomcat server web apps folder this is called a deployment of the project deployment of the project right so now after deployment is over next what we have to do we need to start the server i am starting my server i am starting my server my server is started after starting the server the next will make a request open the browser and will make a request so how to make a request like this http colon double slash local host colon 2014 project name welcome welcome app slash url pattern welcome we are getting what welcome to sarlate technology right welcome to sarlate technology getting or not yes now here we are not getting the color why because here we did some mistake what is the mistake spelling mistake a mistake what is the mistake bg color equal to so now bg color equal to that is the problem so if you are did small mistake then must and should we need to stop the server and once again we have to recompile recompile and uh, restart the server where is that welcome server open that one and body bg color equal to body bg color equal to then take this location take this location and the next cd space paste now we can compile once again java c welcome sir dot java the next java sorry now it's over compilation right then once again we have to restart the server now restart the server now i am restarting the my server right the next open the browser and we'll make a request http colon localhost colon welcome project sorry welcome app welcome app slash url pattern welcome welcome then enter now we are getting the color right 
Previously, the problem is okay. We did some mistake. What is that uh, spelling mistake? This is what type of page? This is the dynamic web page. This is the dynamic web page, but not static web page. Okay, now whenever we are written the any code inside the starlet, inside the starlet, then we can say that that is the dynamic page only. Here we are written to the okay some HTML code where we are written inside the starlet. Inside the starlet we are written to the some HTML code. That is the reason here. Even though we are written the HTML code inside this Java, that means inside this starlet. then we can say that uh, such type of pages dynamic web pages this page was going to produced by the container this page was going to produced by the container called uh, servlet container that is the reason we can say that this is this is dynamic web page dynamic web page static web page means by using html css javascript we can use those uh, web technologies and we can designing the static web page that is nothing but a static web page this is the dynamic web page right that's all the next session we will see the remaining okay how to how to develop the how to develop the generic servlet how to implementing the generic servlet and how to do that task we will see on monday